you guys have to make a video together. Right. I honestly feel like if I stepped in her premises, that bitch would like right hook my face. No. Not that bitch, like she's a bitch. I mean, like that female. <laughs> You're like, scared. Yeah. Look at you. <laughs> Do I want to smack Tana Mojo in the face? Good morning, banana babes. Just woke up and I'm on the computer trying to find some blinds for this area here. Remember that we did have the blinds up, the bamboo kind of look, but it just didn't cover anything up. You know, all the light was coming in. It was just kind of this aesthetic thing, which, yeah, looked cool, but not practical. So I'm trying to find some that actually make the space black, you know, like black out the light so I can wake up when I want to wake up, not when the sun wants to wake me up, even though it is really beautiful to wake up early with the sun. And that is always a goal, but also at night. So the room is dark. It's just really healthy. It's good for your hormones, good for your rest. And like, that's why I wear this face mask, you know, to make it totally black and it does work, but I'd rather not wear something on my face. Also drinking some sugar cane juice, as you can see here and about to get the day started. Also covering up my nipples. And what else am I doing today? I'm going to go to the gym. I've got this seven day pass that is running out very soon, but I'm going to continue going because I just, I love the gym. I love the results I'm getting. And you know, it just reminds me of when I used to be a trainer for years. So good times there. And I got to get them gains, you know, got to get them gains and also going to get some like ceramic pots and stuff like that and do a few things. So come along with me. Let's go. Okay, so I haven't got to the gym yet. I decided to do some sun baking because it's been kind of raining a little bit last couple of days and the sun came out. So I'm like, I've got to get out in that. It's so, so beautiful. Jog, not exactly walk, something in between. Well, I could see, you know, 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I don't mind at all. People do it all the time. But when you take it to the level of slandering, defaming and lying about someone, of course, I'm going to have an issue with that. Everybody's going to have an issue about bullshit being put out about them and then being misrepresented. That's just natural. So that is a clear you know, difference between speaking factually and just speaking bullshit. Anyway, I just wanted to clarify that because that's ridiculous. Okay, so the lesson of the day, my little banana babes. Let's check it out. We have all these cards. I'm not cheating. I promise I'm not cheating. Okay, let's just get in here. Um, cards everywhere. Ugh. Here it is. Okay, there it is. Don't make assumptions. Ask for what you want, okay? Find the courage to ask for what you want. Others have the right to tell you yes or no, but you always have the right to ask. Likewise, everybody has the right to ask you for what they want and you have the right to say yes or no. This is definitely very true. This is very powerful because a lot of people hold back and they don't ask for what they want because they're scared of being judged, they're scared of being rejected. Just fucking go for it, okay? Just like have a go. It's better off having a go, right? Better off having a go and being rejected and just knowing where you stand rather than being like, oh, I don't want to ask. Oh my God, what's going to happen? Like, oh shit, you know, they might say no to me. Who fucking cares if they say no? Who fucking cares? You know, it's not a big deal unless you make it a big deal in your head. At least you know then. Because imagine if you don't ask, imagine all the potential amazing experiences that you won't experience just because you didn't go there. I mean, you could apply this to a relationship and, you know, imagine you like someone, but you're too scared. You know, you don't want to be rejected. You don't want to go and ask that person out. You don't want to show interest in them in case they're like, holy shit, like, I don't like you. Oh my God, that's disgusting, blah, blah, blah. You know, in case they, they think that way of you. Fuck it, like, just put it out there. You know, the only thing that's going to be hurt is your ego. So get over the ego and realize this isn't, you know, this shouldn't be a concern for you. It's better off to actually know where you stand and to be brave and to just fucking have a go. So this is definitely a lesson for me as well, you know, ask for what you want. I think I'm quite good at that. I'm quite good at asking, but at the same time, I do have some uncomfortable situations where I'm like, oh, I don't want to offend that person. Oh, I don't want to hear that, that reply from them, blah, 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 that sort of thing. But you know what? You just got to go for it at the end of the day, put it out there and, you know, just visualize the best result. Okay, so that's today's vlog. If you enjoy these vlogs, make sure you give it a thumbs up, leave any comments, let me know about the green pots, and I will see you tomorrow. Love you guys. Take care of yourself. Keep it fresh. See you soon.